Good afternoon, nature lovers, and welcome to another Nature Drawing Wednesday with your friends at the Peel District School Boards. Today, we are going to be drawing a praying mantis. If at any point during this video, you feel it's hard to keep up, feel free to pause and follow along at your own pace. Now we're gonna start with the head of the praying mantis, and we're gonna start by drawing a rounded triangle like that. Now praying mantises have two compound eyes like most insects do. So we're gonna put those great big eyes right in the corners. And I'm gonna put a little spot of light right inside there and fill those in just to give it a little bit of character. Praying mantises have incredible vision and they're excellent hunters. These eyes they have help them to see uh, for very long distances and they even have three normal eyes in amongst the compound ones. So there we go, we start with the eyes and then we're gonna move on to the thorax. That section that connects to the head just with a little loop like that. We're gonna move on to the abdomen section and praying mantises have two sets of wings. So we're gonna go straight across and we're gonna dip down and back up like that. Now that would be one set of wings. Let's put a second just by tracing the outline of what we just made. And then below that, we're gonna add in the abdomen. So we're gonna trace once more, dipping down, and we're gonna put a couple of little grooves right around just like that. Time to move on to the legs. Like most insects, praying mantises have six sets of legs. So let's start with the back ones. We're gonna angle a little section down like that. From there, we're gonna come up with a leg part that looks very much like that of a grasshopper. We're then gonna just draw a line down like that. I'm just going to thicken that up a little bit and we're going to put on the two feet. Now praying mantises have hairy legs. So throughout this drawing, each time we draw those legs, we're going to draw a little bit of hair on there, just like that. These hairs are great for climbing and for grasping. So we're going to do our back leg the same way. Just fill that in and come down, put a couple of hairs on there because we can. We're gonna move on, put another set of legs here. So we're gonna dip down. And we're gonna make that leg part come way out this time. Like that. And bending down with a little foot. And of course, just a couple of hairs. We're gonna add one more of those. And we're gonna go the same way. We're gonna bring a line out that connects to that part of the leg. And we're gonna drop that down, add a foot, and of course our hair. Now, he needs his front grabbing legs, uh, which are a very important part of the way this insect eats. So praying mantises are very powerful and their arms are quite strong. So we're gonna draw one in there. We're gonna draw another section that comes across, kind of like a triangle. And we're gonna draw those little grasping hands and of course, some leg hair. We're gonna draw one more of those coming right off beside it. Coming across. Two grasping legs and of course, some hair. Now, this praying mantis wouldn't be complete without its two antenna. So we're gonna just have some fun with those. Curve them up and loop around. Curve them up and loop around. And there you have it for today's Nature Drawing Wednesday, our praying mantis. Feel free to share with us on Twitter or on Instagram. You can hashtag, hashtag Peel Connected, hashtag Nature Drawings, Hashtag PLFC. And on Twitter, you can find us 
at peel underscore FC. On Instagram, you can find us at PDSB Field Centers, Center C E N T R E S. And we hope to see your drawing shared with us on those platforms. Thanks for joining us today. See you next Wednesday.